Mr. Feng Sheng, CEO of Teramin Australia. To demonstrate what, follow, what follows, I will be a little bit savvy and use the minimum of common sense. Some information from your web, website. Tala Hamza, Tala Hamza Zinc, uh, Zinc project. Teramin has continued to make positive progress in its negotiations with major constructions groups regarding the funding and construction of the project. Bird in Hand Gold Project in South Australia. Legal proceedings in the Supreme Court of South Australia seeking judicial review of the South, of the South Australian government decisions continue to progress. The matter is expected to be heard in the Supreme Court on the 14th October 2024. Tala project. Tala Hamza Zinc Zinc Project. Tala Hamza Zinc Project is one of the largest and developed zinc and lead deposits in the world, containing 3.5 million tons of zinc, plus with a resource of 53 million tons at 6.6% zinc plus lead. Tala Hamza is located on the Mediterranean coast of Algeria, approximately 15 kilometers from the port city of Bejaya. Important, Bejaya has a population of over 3,000 people with an export deep water port facility and an international airport. The project is close to major rail, road and energy infrastructures. Teramin holds a 49% shareholding in WMZ and holds management rights in respect of Talahda. The remaining uh, nine, 91 person is held by two Alger Algerian government owned companies, Entreprise Nationale des Produits min Miniers Non Ferreux et des Substances Utiles, l'ENAF, 48.5 uh, person, and Office Nationale de Recherche Ge Géologique et Minière, ORGM, 2.5 person. <coughs> in May 2023, Teramin was pleased to announce the achievement of, all of a major project milestone with the Algerian mining regulator is issuing the mining permit for Tel Hamza. The issue of the mining permit means that Tala Hamza has satisfied all Algerian regular, regulatory, uh, financial and environmental requirements and that it can now proceed to war, towards development. In collaboration with our Algerian partners, this mining permit will, will allow for the mining and processing of 2.0 MTPA of ore instead of the 1.3 MTPA anticipated in the 2018 Tala Hamza Definitive Feasibility Study, indicating that project returns will be enhanced over the anticipated 20 plus year mile life. 
the mining the mining permit on compasses all the area of land required for operation of the mine including mining processing whole roads or stockpiles paving dams concentrate handling and maintenance and administration in october 2023 the Algerian government is sure issued an executive decree of public utility decree in respect of Tahla. Very important. The decree was signed by the Prime Minister of Algeria, Ayman Abdelrahman. The issue of the decree triggered the process for the acquisition of the land by the Algerian government, which covers the footprint of the Talahamza mining permit. I repeat, the decree was signed by the Prime Minister of Algeria, Mr. Ayman Abdelrahman. The issue was the, the issue of the decree triggered the process for the acquisition of the land by the Algerian government, which covers the footprint of the, of the Tel Hamza mining permit. This land of an area of approximately 234 hectares will then be made available to the project to undertake its operations the land will support all the project mining and processing operations as well as direct ramp access to highway to highway which is currently under construction that leads directly to the port of Bejaya, approximately 15 kilometers to the north and important electricity and gas infrastructure important following the issue of the decree the algerian government has progressed the acquisition of the land and terramin expects the process to be completed early in the coming coming months and the land being available to the project soon after <laughs> <coughs> Terramina has continued to make positive progress in its negotiations with major construction groups regarding the funding and construction of the project. This process includes extensive, extensive due diligence and site visits. This process includes extensive due diligence and site visits. The zinc price has continued to rally strongly in recent months with the price trading trading near US dollar. 1850. The increase in zinc price is largely, largely due to a significant tightening in zinc concentrate supply due to several high cost mines closing, most notably Bolitan's Taramine in Ireland. Nilstar's Middle Tennessee operations and Toho Zeng Rasp Mine in Australia. Bird in Hand Gold projects and Ongas Zinc Mine site. In August 2023, Termin filed legal proceedings in the Supreme Court of South Australia seeking judicial review of the refusal of the applications, the refusal 
of the applications and the making of the, the recommendation to the governor. Teramin contends, amongst other things, that each decision should be set aside on the basis that the de decisions misapprehended the statutory power in the Mining Act 1971, where legally unreasonable did not take into account relevant consideration, took into account an irrelevant consideration and the theramin was not accorded procedural fairness and theramin was not accorded procedural fairness. The legal proceedings are continuing to progress with the matter which has been subject to procedural hearings directions hearings during and subsequent to the quarter it is expected that the matter will be heard in the supreme court on the 14 14 october 2024 contents of the processing of your application to bird in hand gold project and ongas zinc mine site by the government of South Australia. Here it is. <coughs> oh no. Function now. All what I did before is reading extracts from your website. What I did before is listing some facts. That's it. Now I will begin the demonstration. Now all what will follow are my words, my own words. We are May 9th, 2024. Yesterday, it was May 8th, 2024. It was a sad day, sad day for our national and international memories. In 1945, France of the King Emmanuel Macron did a triple Uradusur Grana three genocides and war crimes in Genma, city and Hrata. Do you know that by eyes bird, Hrata is next to Telahanja, your mining site? Okay. Tenchen. In my afterlife, in the year after, I want to rest in peace near my, near my loved ones. Near Nesmatu, Husnay Khamed and my diamond. This is my spiritual goal. <coughs> I am strongly opposed to the domination by and disaster induced by the King of France, Emmanuel Macron, in my country. You are, you are the second manager whom against I will harshly fight. Feng Cheng, you are the second manager whom against I will harshly fight. I will tirelessly work for my homeland in order to avoid the squat the squadron of its natural wealth and go all out to fend off 
the Teramin hostile attack in Bejaya and in its looming war in Tizimzu, targeting Ajnad and Maqas. You can find a complaint with me. You can sue me in any worldwide court because I will be acting as your actionary, your nemesis. From China, years ago, at HC Montreal, in a group of students, I worked on the com comparison of the results, the results, the profits of Bombardier Canada, Avid China, and Ombre Brazil. Fighting by time, my unique argument to the losses of Bombardier and enormous profit that profits of Avic and Umbrella was the lack in the investment in investment in research and development over more than five years of Bombardier. More, meanwhile, its competitors did the opposite. Thus, for me, working in the your working on your company is just a disgusting joke, a wasting time. Working on the Teramin project in Tarahusa is a joke for me. It's also a wasting time. Yaksan al is an Algerian journalist. He is one of the innocents who are in the Algerian jails, prisons. He is my brother. If he was free, I would write for the group player that he is managing a costly paid 360 degree view analysis. <coughs> the first time I warned about uh, I warned the Algerian people of uh, dealing with your company was in 2014, ten years before. If Teramin was uh, strong and serious, it would it would leave Algeria years ago by continuing, persisting in your action, you give us the tri triple proof that your company needs an injection of an enormous amount of money to survive. Algeria is an easy target, as a prey, and you wish to skyrocket Teramin share, share prices with speculation on the highly and risky volatile penny share market at the expense of my country and in its, its nation. If it were up to me, the, the, these two brackets. If it were up to me, these two graphics are sufficient to eliminate, eliminate tyranny and expel it once for all from Algeria. For the damaging consequences of international business law trials that will endure the Algerian state, I have to keep my composure and act, explain wisely this terrific plundering piage 
operation of its critical materials, strategic metals, and rare, rare earth elements. The spookiest trials can take place before the ICC of Paris or London. DSP, Dispute Settlement Body of the World Trade Organization, WTO. International Center for Settlement of Investment Disputes, ICSID, World Bank. Let's go on to the financial side of Terramin, of the sick Terramin, sick, rubbish, garbage. A penny share is any company which share price is below five dollars. Five dollars. Your share price is 0.037. A <coughs> penny share company is anyone which share price is below and five US dollars. Five. Just five. Your company, the price of the share of Termin share is 0 0.037 Australian dollars. Okay. Another a small comparison. <coughs> when we compare it to the Apple one, Microsoft and Nvidia prices, we notice that your company, that your, the value of your company is something like this, zero dollar. When we compare it to Apple, Microsoft, and Nvidia, your company, the value of the capitalization of your company is near zero. Okay. Another question. Is there a been listed on Niles? New York. TSX? Toronto. HTEX? X? Hong Kong. DFM? Dubai. AGX? Cairo. And SG? B, V, Algiers. The answer is no. Why? Why your company is not listed on the main uh, stock market? You are scared by a hostile takeover in the current bullish and not bearish market of strategic metals like zinc, lithium and pantalon. Which company can, can swallow yours? Which company can swallow Tramil? The Australian behemoth BHP managed by the Canadian Mike Henry will pay at most 80 million dollars a pin money for a BHP. Function, Teramin CEO. As you know, the presidential race in Algeria is scheduled for September 2024. 
I wish to be a contender. If elected, Terra Mena will be in the top five, top five companies. Those contracts will be disclosed, no matter their secret clauses. In the mining sector and the protection of the nature, my future Algerian government will lead a huge and enormous process in dissecting all the contracts and screening fraudulent maneuvers and any willful. For this, I already sent letter to the United Nations, World Bank and IMF, in which I had re remembered the International Bruna Initiative for Algeria and its neighborhood, Morocco, Tunisia, Mali, Niger, and Libya. In your report about Tel Hamza, it said that Vijaya has a population over 3,000 3, people. In 2022, Algeria did a census. The Algerian authorities must give you the new statistics because the impact of the economic, social cost of any difference will be dramatic. Gigantic. The pollution, the pollution of the air, the destruction of the nature and the economy, <coughs> either local or national, will produce, induce additional externalities, sicknesses, earth depletion. Uh, inflation in consumer goods and disastrous deflation in housing, over Setif, Jijil, and Tizuzu. The havoc of Tiramin project is wider than Bejaya. The fall of Kfrida, the Chute de Kfrida, Ziama Mosulia Wonder Caves, the <coughs> Grotte Merveilleuse de Ziama, the Black Lake, the Lac Noir at Fadou, will be irreversibly destroyed. After this, this first snapshot, I have to come back to the financial side. Now, I come back to the financial side. You issued shares in millions, in billions. The curve of your, the curve of the of your stock prices says this curve says that Terramin has an electrocardiogram of a dead person of a cadaver la courbe des prix du cours de l'action de Terramin ressemble à l'électrocardiogramme d'une personne morte ou d'un cadavre. The other graphic, this one, shows your, own, your ongoing and high losses. Il montre vos pertes permanentes, vos très hautes pertes et permanentes, continuelles. That's why you want to bail it out 
with the public wealth of the Algerian weak state. In your report, you, you confess your collapse and crash. Teramid has continued to make positive progress in its negotiations with major constructing groups regarding the funding and construction of the, the project. It's a proof that Teramid has collapsed, has crashed. In the same report, Teramin holds 49% uh, shareholdings in WMZZ and holds management rights in respect of Tarahamza. The remaining 91% no, 91 is held by two Algerian government-owned companies, Enough and Oergerba. By owning the management rights, Teramin gives another proof that your Algerian partners are non significant. They are just bystanders who maybe benefit private funny travels to Australia and elsewhere. It shows also that the Algerian 51% uh, holdings do have the lowest voting rights. If it's the case, WMZ, WMZ can be considered as your private property. Be aware that WMZ can be considered as your private company is the core topic of my address. Prenez note que WMZ sera considéré comme une propriété privée et le cœur et le noyau de mon adresse. Just at this level, at this stage, you agree with me that I have increased the cost of the bribe corruption that you will pay in the future if this project, the project is still cut. And I have also exacerbated insider trading, the DVDC, on the cropland prices. <coughs> Community involvement and sustainable development. The redoubt about the elimination, your elimination, in Bird in Hand Gold project published by the government of South Australia and only on the social and amenities side is in 186 page. Just this is the table of con your content, the content. C'est le contenu de la table des matières. What about, what about the Algerian assessment? How many pages are de dedicated to Algerian assessment? Three. And only three. Not page, lines. Only three lines. In this assessment, you have said, Teramin has said that they have used, that it has used, it had used Monte Carlo analysis. 
Pastor Ahmed or the Algerian government conducted by uh, conducted any analysis of this kind for Tala Hamza mining project? No. Monte Carlo, anal Monte Carlo analysis. Fraudulent maneuvers in your report. Les maneuvres frauduleuses. I quote. In collaboration with our Algerian partners, this mining per permit will allow for the mining and processing of 2.0 MTPA of ore instead of the 1.3 MTPA. Tala Hamza def uh, definitive feasibilities today indicating the project's return will be enhanced over the anticipated more than 20 years your your mind life so in 2018 you have said the project of Tala Hamza has a, a capacity of power a volume of 1.3 mtpa and in 2023 you correct it by saying 2.0 mtpa the amount, the, uh, the amount of exploitation, exploitation goes up from 1.3 to 2.0. Your gain is 0 0.7 MTPA. What is the value of this difference? Okay. The second fraudulent maneuver you said. The life of uh, the life of the Tala Hamza mining project is more. It's over twenty years. It's what we call the time inconsistency, l'inconsistence temporelle. For how long is your license, your permit, your contract? Did Teramin pay hush money to keep secret all the contract? Est-ce que Teramin a payé de la hush money pour garder le, 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 le contrat secret? Thank you, Jenna. The call, the mail. About the property rights. I go over the file. <coughs> The term is a free rider. I go over the fact that term is a free rider. Uh, it will use freely these amenities, roads, port, airport, and I have no clue about the types of water, gas, and electricity power that will be built to your company. In your public report, we read that Tiramin holds a 49% shareholdings in WMZ and holds management rights in respect of Tala Hamza. And in October 2023, the Algerian government issued an executive decree of public utility. Uh, the decree was signed by the Prime Minister of Algeria, Ayman Abdurrahman. This land of an area of approximately 234 hectares will then be made available to the project to undertake its operations. It's a fraudulent maneuver. The land will support all the project mining and processing operation. What these words mean? Taking, a, taking advantage of the weaknesses of the Algerian military staff and its uh, presidency. The public money will pay for you all the expo expropriations of the land owners 
and face all the opposition by threat, repression, torture, and jail. Okay? <laughs> we add all these quotes, course, we sum, we sum them up. And because you are the legal owner, the legal owner of the WMZ, you can resell Tala Hamza Mal to any enormous company from USA, Canada, China, uh, any other shadow company. Or more than this, put it as mortgage, warranty in a big bank as HSSBC, Alpha Bank, or Goldman Sachs. If the Algerian state wants to use his preemption right, he will rebuy its natural. A natural wealth for maybe 30 billion dollars plus the cost of the disaster, the internalities. In economics, according to Mariana Mazzucato, we call this the value extraction at a gigantic level. Conclusion Teramin is sprouting in Algeria, uprising and violence seeds. Terrific injustice because the prosec prosecutors and judges will sentence maybe to to death, innocent, brave, and passionate Algerians in the resignation of the lawyers and advocates. For myself, I will redo this kind of work for all the other criminal projects as shale gas, offshore oil, and mining in the southern of Algeria. It was in 2015 that I alerted about this upheaval. 